Hello, my name is Kanai Mitchell. This is Wilfred Powell. This is Brian Glenn. And, and you're, you're watching, watching the, the Theron News, News Show. Show. Good morning, Theron Panthers. Today is Friday, November 10th, 2017. I'm Trevor George, and welcome to the Panthers News Show. Well, we had an opportunity to catch up with Sergeant Major Johnson to get a little bit more information about the empty stocking fund as well as the Veterans Day Parade. Take a look. Hello, America. How you doing? I'm Command Sergeant Major Johnson, retired United States Army for over 30 years. So this past weekend, we did what's called the Empty Stocking Fund fundraiser, which we raised uh, close to $3,000 for underprivileged kids who can also get something in their stocking this year. Also, we got coming up this weekend is the Veterans Day Parade, which for all my veterans out there, uh, we have uh, close to 50 uh, students probably going out with us this weekend on Saturday uh, for the Veterans Day Parade. Like I said, it's for a good cause for all the veterans who gave uh, their final sacrifice uh, as a hero. And they shed their blood, sweat, and tears for this country. And I think it's a great deal that we recognize all the veterans, past and present. Students, if you are interested in attending the Veterans Day Parade, make sure that you see one of the local Army instructors around the campus. The CCC presents For the College Culture, Career and Motivational Week kicking off next Monday. Monday, the College and Career Advisors are starting off the week with the CCC Breakfast Bar for the 9th and 10th grades. Get to school on time to ask them questions about how you can prepare for college as a freshman and a sophomore and receive a breakfast treat. During first period, what's the price? FAFSA in class for seniors will be taking place so they can complete their 2018-2019 FAFSA applications. So seniors, don't forget to sign up during your senior advisory to get assistance with your FAFSA application. In a day, everybody will be posted up at the Pipe It Up kickoff rally with V103. There will be free giveaways for students who are ready to be college bound. The College Advisors are back at it again with the CCC Breakfast for 11th and 12th graders. Stop by and ask the College Advisors a question about how you can prepare for college and receive a breakfast treat. Wednesday, no complaints applied to the college in class session for seniors who were so turned up we had to bring it back again on Wednesday. Career skill workshops are also taking place and professionals will be coming in discussing social media, how to pay for college, and much more. Get Right With Your Motivational Speaker Day is taking off during the morning while GPA Reloaded Lunch and Learn for Seniors starts off during lunch. If you're still undecided about what you want to do after high school, come to the CCC to take a career assessment and chat it up with the college advisors. Oh yeah, College Bound Thursday starts from 3.30 until 4.45 p.m. in the CCC. Seniors, come send your SAT and ACT scores off, apply for some more colleges or scholarships, or even prep for the SAT. And lastly, Friday, the Big on Big College and Career Fair will take place. I'm going to get information about different colleges, universities, military branches, and work-based programs. And remember to use our For the College Culture Snapchat filter all day Monday. Well, students, as you may know, last night was the senior investiture where the graduating class of 2018 received pins and were inducted into the graduating class. But the race is not over. Two 
Tuesday, May 22nd, 2018, 5.30 p.m. When you walk across that stage in your beautiful red and black at the Georgia World Congress Center, that will be the rest of your life. Therefore, I challenge you to give more than what is expected. I challenge you to annihilate complacency. I challenge you to demand excellence in every aspect of your life. I challenge you to be your beautiful self and be powerful beyond measure. You are brilliant. You are gorgeous. You are talented and you are fabulous. And you are the 2018 senior class of Daniel McLaughlin Thera High School. Remember me on the new show talking about the IB program? What is an International Baccalaureate program? You can say IB program for short. It helps us to become knowledgeable and caring to other people's cultures. How would this help me after graduating? Through the IB program, your teacher will help you become a better person when facing real world challenging situations. Here are some more information talking about it. The International Baccalaureate is a global learning community of inquiring students, passionate educators and engaged parents. Around the world, more than 4,000 schools offer a different kind of learning experience where we all strive to be open-minded, inquiring, risk-taking, reflective, principled and caring. Four programs of education for 3 to 19 year olds make up the IB continuum, challenging learners everywhere to excel in their studies and personal growth. It starts with the primary years program, which sets up the IB's youngest learners to be curious and self-motivated, both in the classroom and in the world outside. When I researched the IB, I was far, far, by far most, the most excited about it. And it was really um, the focus on, I'd say, the social emotional skills and the deeper level thinking skills that I felt there was such an emphasis on, the critical thinking, the reflection. I think it's just maybe a better person in general. I'm open to new ideas, I'm more caring. I remember, I have to do this better. It's like, let's say, I'm nervous, I have to be more of a risk taker. If I am being kind of mean, I'll say I have to be more caring. The Middle Years program encourages learners to make practical connections between their studies and the real world. I honestly think the most important skill we're learning right now is uh, analyzing because not only do you analyze poetry or a text, you also can use it to your daily lives, like at a situation that you can't understand, you can sit and break it down into how you can deal with the situation, how you can solve it. In the MYP, uh, students are connecting what they are learning to real life, so it makes it more relevant for them and uh, more meaningful. The diploma program develops students who are able to flourish physically, intellectually, emotionally and ethically. I feel like if I had gone to any other school I wouldn't have gotten all this training I would say in being aware that there are people out there that are different from me and I feel like it's really helped me to understand these differences and I feel like after IB, I can go out into the world and be successful wherever I go. They're going to go into the world and they're going to be successful, but that success is for others as well. You know, they want to be successful for the community, for, for the world. It, it's not about personal gain all of the time. And so they're going out with a sensitivity as to their, their role in the world. The career-related programme equips learners with a combination of academic, practical and emotional skills for the modern world. My experience in the IB has been very grateful for me 
pues es una manera para crecer tanto como persona y tanto profesionalmente, ya que esto va dirigido a que pueda seguir mis estudios de manera profesional y de una manera internacional, ya que esto me abre las puertas, no solo de aquí recibir una educación que se base solo en el sistema de México, sino algo más internacional, algo más profesional. We see students um, starting with the usual sort of teenage worries and concerns and nervousness and coming out as really competent, confident young people, able to um, talk to um, adults, to head things up, to lead things with a massive community awareness. They do projects and services within the community. Um, so they have a much bigger appreciation of their local community, but a global awareness as well. The IB Continuum. Education for a better world. Well, Panthers, that concludes this new show. Hopefully you've had an amazing week here at the best high school in Atlanta, DM Thero High School. I'm Trevor George, and have an amazing weekend, and we'll see you all next week.